Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be talking to you about something that affects students. If you are a student, stick around, or if you're planning on going to university in the UK, stick around. If you're not and you know someone who is planning on going to university, then stick around because it might benefit them. I'm going to be talking to you about DSA or Disabled Students Allowance, which is something that you can apply for when you're applying for student finance. If you don't know what student finance is, it's something in England that pays for university for you. And you go through university, you're paid if you are disabled or you have a mental illness, you also qualify for something called Disabled Students Allowance, which it's great that it's for mentally ill people as well as autistic people and physically disabled people. And that is something that pays for equipment and software for you. For example, I've got a printer, some noise cancelling headphones are on the way for me, a microphone that means I can record lectures, stuff like that. There's loads. There's mind mapping tools. Basically, I didn't know about it before before the support at the uni I'm at now told me about it. So I think more people should be told about it. It's just a little box you tick and then you have a study needs assessment, which is a video call with someone for talking about what you need in order to help you learn. They can also pay for a study needs tutor, which is someone you meet with every so often. It's up to you how many times and talk about how you're doing and talk about what you're struggling with and they can point you in the right direction and they can help you. They can pay for transport. So if they will pay for printer ink, I will pay for printer ink and then send them the receipt and they'll give me the money back in my bank account. They also pay for insurance for technology which is great i'm yet to get my new computer ins insured but when i get it insured they're going to pay me back for that for the length of my entire degree so it's great and i think people should be told about it like told what it actually is and i think it's going to benefit me so yeah if you guys would like i can do a rundown of what i got in more detail let me know down in the comments or by liking this video if you would like that so yeah that's a quick video about disabled students allowance i hope you enjoyed it and i hope it will benefit at least one of you see you next time mm -hmm.